Hi everyone, so this is actually part two of the Bring Back My Bar December 2020 haul. Um, my camera cut me off, so I really apologize about that. Um, if you haven't seen part one, I'll go ahead and link that um, up here and also in the description. Um, yeah, I didn't realize that my camera would cut me off. Such a dingbat. But let's continue. I left off at Quiet Grove, okay? So I was basically saying that this wax is the feminine version of my dear Watson. And I think that these two would pair really, really well together. Um, his and her. Yeah, um, so if you like that, um, like that rich bergamot, like heavy cologne smell, then you would probably enjoy both of these. This one, the jasmine just makes it really feminine and lighter. So I kind of like Quiet Grove, so we'll see. Next is Sweet Amber and Freesia, and that's what the label looks like. And it is this really pretty pink colored wax. I love that color. So the scent description is crisp layers of verbena blossom, freesia, and sweet amber. And yeah, this one is very floral. Um, you definitely get the freesia and the blossom. Very potent floral. But it's like a, a floral perfume. And on cold sniff, it smells like it's going to be really, really strong. And I like my home fragrance strong. Um... I'll have to warm this and find out if the floral is a little too overpowering. Like, um, Simply Rose. I actually ended up taking that one out of my Scentsy Club. I love it. It's just, I have a few bars of it, and it's so strong that I actually stopped using one whole cube unless my windows are going to be open. I actually cut it in half and use half a cube. That's how strong it is, and I'm like, okay, so my few bars will last me quite a while, but, um, I like this, Sweet Amber and Freesia. It's a very pretty floral. So if you like florals, give that a try. Next is Sweet Plum Pastry. It's got the purple label and the wax is this like um, plum color. So the scent notes are black plum and toasted coconut garnish a marshmallow cloud and this was actually one of the ones that I wanted to come back. Yes, I love this. Um, you get like um, that sweet, it's very sweet and it's like a bakery plum. But you can smell like um, the creamy marshmallow. But somehow it smells baked. There's a bakery note to it. Um, and that may be the toasted coconut, now that I think about it. But, yeah, this is wonderful. I understand now why people hoard this, why people stock up on this. It's it's really beautiful. Um, I When I was a customer, I actually passed on this. I wasn't sure, I mean, before I became a Scentsy Consultant. I, I don't really love plum. It's not my favorite of the fruits. I'm more of like a raspberry girl, but... Um, so I passed on this one, but I really love it. And I'm so glad that it came back because I'm going to be buying a lot more of that. That is sweet plum pastry. Next is vanilla oud. And this is what the label looks like. And the wax is like this, um, like a milk chocolate, almost like a cake batter color. So the scent notes are sweet vanilla grounded by leather and earthy oud wood so okay so why does this smell like breakfast blend are you guys familiar with that one it's retired now but it was two catalog seasons ago i believe okay so you get vanilla and let me smell the bottom because i'm getting coffee <laughs> Okay, so on the bottom, okay, I smell like this really, really rich vanilla, and then I get like um, the leather and the wood, but I also get coffee. It's like, let's say like a cowboy is sitting in a wooden barn with leather chaps on, 
drinking a vanilla coffee. <laughs> Silly, but but that's what I smell. I smell coffee. Okay, you guys, please comment. Am I standing out here alone? Does anyone else get coffee? Because I'm getting coffee vibes from this. And I really like this. I really like it. Um, yeah, I'm going to be buying more of that. So comment and let me know. If I'm crazy, if my nose has just, you know, lost its, its sense of smell or something. But I smell coffee. But I like this. I love coffee smells. So I really like vanilla oud. Next is vanilla suede and um this is like a um like a milk chocolate like a light chocolatey color that's nice classic vanilla with rich amber and hints of sandalwood and spice a subtly masculine fragrance and you definitely get vanilla and and vanilla and amber and then you get that suede note. Let me, uh, let me smell the bottom. And suede. But the suede is very soft. This is nice. I like it. But these two are very... They're pretty similar. Um, this one smells like coffee. though. <laughs> but, oh my gosh. Yeah, I like this one too. I love vanilla. Like, I love anything vanilla. So, very, like, masculine. Yeah, I would say both of these are masculine scents. Yeah, so so those are the top 20 um for me. With I'm definitely going to be adding to my Scentsy Club Marshmallow Mint. Love this. And Black Current Bubbly. This is I I don't know if I like this one or Pink Haze more, but this may be number 1. I love it. Um I'm also going to add Cutie Pie Cupcake to my Scentsy Club. Sweet Plum Pastry. Oh yes, Lavender and White Balsam. Yeah, definitely Plum and White Woods for sure. And then I'm going to buy more. This is incredible. Like I like all of these except for Amber Hollow. Sorry, Amber Hollow fans. I'm sorry. I just really don't like that one, but um, Oh my gosh, I need more of Apple S'mores. I don't think that one's going in my club though. Cashmere Pear is so pretty. And Pumpkin Marshmallow or Sweet Potato Pie. Um, so I've got six definites going into my club right now. And then I might add Pumpkin Marshmallow and Cashmere Pear as well. So that would mean eight new bars going in my Scentsy Club. And then you know I can't just get one. Of like um, black currant bubbly, cutie pie cupcakes, sweet plum pastry. I need multiple bars. So my Scentsy Club is about to become enormous. Um, yeah, so please comment. Let me know what you're excited for, what you voted for, what you think. Let me know if my nose has gone crazy on that vanilla oud. <laughs> if you smell any coffee, i love to know you guys stopped by my channel. And thank you so much for spending the past few minutes with me. I really appreciate it. And please like and subscribe for more Scentsy content. And I will see you in my next video. Bye, friends.